guys, it's Tana. Today is my first video of 2016 and I'm actually really excited because I'm going to be sharing with you guys my New Year's resolutions. And one thing I want to say, even just before I start, is that I kind of don't even believe in this whole resolution thing. Not that I don't believe in it, but just that like, I kind of feel like you should just set goals for yourself and do things every day, any time of the year, any second. Once you get that epiphany, that thing, you're like, I want to do this do it right then and there. I understand why people do it and why people have resolutions and it's a new start and it does take some people like that kind of fresh start to get them into a new spirit and like doing new things. So I totally get that. I totally get the whole resolution thing. So I'm not trying to like bash that um, because I am going to be setting some resolutions or like new year goals for myself. Um, but I definitely set goals for myself constantly. Like every day I have a new goal for myself. So I don't know, I just kind of wanted to share some of the ones that I'm starting off the new year with and maybe some of you guys will get some ideas on things that you can set for your goals if you guys have similar places that you want to be in life or things that you want to do. I kind of want to encourage like a conversation too. So definitely go in the comments, write your resolution down there. Tell me why it's your resolution. Don't just say, I want to drink more water. Just say why, you know, I want to know. I really want us to like talk to each other and like discuss our resolutions, discuss our goals and just talk about things we want to do because goal setting is something that is so important and something that I really want all of you guys to do we're gonna start so okay let me tell you guys my first resolution or goal for this new year is to not be distracted or using my phone while I drive okay so this one kind of comes with a story so when I moved to, when I moved to LA I started using navigation all the time like I had my phone just like in my hand or like you know up like I was looking at it the whole time while I was driving and I realized that I'm like that is just so bad like I feel so bad like doing that and putting other people in danger, putting myself in danger, but really just other people, honestly, because it's just so irresponsible to be on your phone, to be texting, to be doing anything that's distracting to you while driving. So I, I started this before the new year. I was talking to my friends. I was just like, I don't, I don't want to do this anymore. This is so bad. So they're like, just start, just start today. I'm like, heck yeah, I'm going to start today. So I think that if you are someone who is distracted while driving, who texts, who looks at their phone, just wait till the red light or even just don't like text the hashtag X to your friend. If you're texting them right before you go, get everything done while you're parked and safe. It's just a good way to do it, guys. It's really, honestly, that's one of the biggest things I think that everyone should strive for in 2016 because I see it all over the road. This next thing is something I kind of thought of a couple days ago and I told my sister about it and she was like, yeah, that's really good. And it's basically to do something with intent every single day. And that can mean anything. That can mean whatever you want it to mean. I like this one because it's really flexible and it's not really realistic to set a goal that you can't achieve day by day. And I think that that's how goals are achieved. They're definitely achieved in small bursts day by day, inching towards your goals rather than like doing one big thing and that then you reach your goal. So like, I feel like waking up and having an intention for that day is gonna help you to achieve more goals in your life because because you're just gonna have that mindset every single day of your life and it doesn't it can be anything like it can be like oh my intention today is to drink more water and that's just for that day and then for the next day maybe it's oh my intention is to get this homework assignment done like it can be anything you want my my intention for today is to wake up and go to the gym because it's not realistic to say I'm gonna wake up I'm gonna go to the gym every day of 2016 you're gonna kind of set yourself up for failure you can't really make changes that way you need to make changes in small bursts and that's just my opinion that that's just what's worked for me in the past so I feel like this is really gonna help a lot of you guys just knowing that you need to get up every day with an intention and a, like something in mind to work at. This next one is about keeping my workspace clean slash room clean slash just keeping a clean area. I love being clean. Like honestly, it's like the thing is like I clean my room all the time. I'm like, I gotta clean my room. I'm like, Alana calls me. I'm like, sorry, I'm cleaning my room. You know, so like, I don't know. I just like to keep everything clean. And like, since I spend like 99% of my life in my room, I like to keep it clean. I'm a person that's already clean. So I could probably do some organization videos or like tips and stuff if you guys want some help like cleaning your room or like getting organized and stuff because I am like people when people ask about me they're like one of the things they would use to describe me is like very organized and clean so I don't know I think I kind of got a handle on that maybe I don't know um yeah so let me know in the comments if you guys want some kind of organization stuff because yeah I'm kind of a master at that so yeah. Okay guys, my last resolution is to vlog more and you guys know I kind of failed on vlogmas. I tried, I tried my best, but sometimes I get a little bit self-conscious honestly vlogging because I'm like not ready every day and like I just don't like looking at myself on camera feeling ugly basically that's really it so but one of the things Alana told me she said 
um, that you should be vlogging to keep these memories and really that's what it's about. It's like you're not going to look like a 10 every single day. You're not going to be with makeup on. You're not going to be freshly showered all the time. So it's really just about capturing the moment. I sound so, I literally sound so cheesy through this whole video you guys, but I'm serious. Like literally I'm so serious. Like I'm being so genuine and I just want to tell you guys like the things that I want to achieve and do because I feel like that's what I kind of set out to do on this YouTube channel. Like I just wanted to be real with you guys and I like I just like doing that so yeah um so vlogging more you guys can subscribe to my vlog channel if you want um it's tana vlog tana 100 subscribe to my social media subscribe to it no follow me on social media my twitter <laughs> twitter my instagram you guys know the drill by now it's 2016 i shouldn't have to tell you okay guys so i hope you guys enjoyed this video like i said let's start a conversation in the comments on twitter on instagram wherever like i want this to be everyone's year because i know sometimes i see on twitter like this is gonna be my year and i find that to be I, I just don't like when people say that because it kind of it puts a bad feeling in my stomach like oh it's just your year like I don't know maybe I'm crazy I, if any of you guys have ever felt like that that's just how I feel so yeah this is gonna be everyone's year this is everyone's year everyone can do it everyone can seize the day like you know I, this is a walking cliche right now but I promise you guys this is like my thoughts I'm just trying to show you guys so yeah um, I hope you guys enjoyed this video and I will talk to you guys in my next one bye guys